White Christmas is definitely an interesting story. I have to say, personally, I didn't love it, but I think it's very creative, and I think it will appeal to a lot of people. This was released in 1995. It's an animated short film directed by Keith Scoble, and it's about two little children, and one of them dreams of a white Christmas. But on Christmas Eve, when Santa visits, he actually wakes the little girl up and says that he's sorry, but I can't give you a white Christmas. Is there anything else you want? And there isn't. So Santa actually arranges for the children to go onto this cloud and meet the various weather elements who are personified and they have various adventures while they're there and they have to um, face the Lightning Twins. And I think the Lightning Twins were pretty well-written, well-described characters and various other um, there are various other characters and problems along the way as they try and work towards getting a white Christmas. And it is definitely a very unique story. I've never, to my knowledge, to my recollection, I don't think I've ever seen a narrative that's quite like this. So definitely credit for being a, a creative idea. And I think one that, that's pretty well written and well executed. It just didn't appeal to me on a personal level. It's just not my kind of story. But the animation style is quite pleasing. So that was quite good. The voice acting across the board is really good. So I do think that there's... An audience for it. I think if it sounds like your kind of narrative, then I think there are enough elements in it that it probably will appeal to you. It's just, it's not for me. So it's okay. And I didn't, I didn't mind watching it. It's about 20 minutes, give or take. So I didn't mind watching it, but I definitely didn't enjoy it, if that makes sense. But I can't, I can't really fault it. It's a decent narrative. It's a creative idea. And the animation is pretty good. So if it sounds like your kind of thing, I'd say it's worth checking out, but it's definitely not one that's for me.